Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Glitchcraft. Woo! It's been a while since I've uploaded a video. What, uh, last time I think I went through the nether? And, uh, ended up at, uh, Zog's nether portal? I think that was the last time I recorded. I play this game mostly to relax, uh, so recording kind of doesn't always fit into that. So I've kind of done a, uh, lot of work since then. And, uh, yeah, so, sorry about that, but, uh, I've been doing a lot of work with, for the museum, and, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll gotta do a video of that later, but, uh, there's flame space over here, it's expanded a little bit, not a lot, he doesn't play that much, and he's got another portal, yay, so that's another thing that comes out, uh, in my portal, unless he actually put forth the effort to you know, make it so that it aligns like I did. Because my portal has its own portal in the nether now. I don't, I won't pop out at uh, Zog's place anymore. I fixed that. All right, so uh, today I am going to be doing an interesting thing. And it's related to what's up there. Okay, so that little X up there that you can see is a power plant of mine. One of the mo most important things to do to get infinite anything in the game is to get infinite power well i do it with by using wind turbines really high up in the sky but as you notice there's a twinkling up there as well which you might be able to notice there's a twinkling up there and once we go up there and it takes a while to get up there because that's at like build height so um <clears throat> just takes a moment but you can start seeing that the twinkling becomes what is obviously a graphical glitch at least what I really, really hope is a graphical glitch. But it's that three times over, basically. So this is just my power provider. This is where I get power from for everything. I have uh, wind turbines, a whole bunch of wind turbines, and a whole bunch of so solar panels. And uh, yeah, that's it. So uh, I have all of these blocks up here so that when you're really close to the ground... Woo! Boom! You, you can't see it. Not really, anyways. I don't have them over there yet, but that's because of what I'm planning to do today. Today, as far as I can tell, outside of a little joke with a potato jet pack and flame, which I really wish I was recording, and I'm very disappointed I wasn't recording. It was hilarious. Um, today is going to be the first prank on the Glitchcraft server. Yes, I have been doing a bit of work, and as you can tell, I have, uh, what are that called? What is this stuff called? This is Applied Energistics. So I've been having some fun with Applied Energistics. I have a whole bunch of storage and stuff, and crafting recipes and crap like that. For, where are you? This stuff down here, the inverted sky block. That's those things up there that makes it so it's, well... Invisible in the right light. Now, over here, let's turn on my jetpack. I can move faster with a jetpack on than I can with it off. Uh, and we'll go over to Zog's Pizza. Now, if you haven't checked out Zog's videos, you should check out Zog's videos. It's actually kind of enter entertaining, if a little sickening, because he's got this haste three thing going now that warps the screen and ugh, makes me want to vomit. All right, so he's got all these pizzas here, and he's very proud of this, and, well, he kind of has some fun with it. If we look in his crafting terminal, if it lets me, it does. Okay, so he's got 9 million gravel, 158 million cobblestone, and, like, over here, he has deep storage units with absolutely ridiculous number of things, uh... 1,793,000 lead, uh, 546,000 glowstone, just absolutely insane levels of crap. Uh, more than he'll ever use, I guarantee on this server. More than he'll ever use. But he does it, and I think he does it just for doing it, you know? Just to say he did it. Which, in my opinion, is a perfectly good reason to do it. 
why the hell else would you do any of this stuff? It's not like it has any real worth practical stuff. He's having fun with it. I'm happy that he's having fun with it. But I want to have some fun with it too. Okay, so the idea is that if if I'm lucky, if I'm lucky, he logged out about here. Okay, so what I want to be able to do is have him log in next time round and not see his pizza slice over there, just Sky. Go over here, not see his new pizza slice over there with all his uh, applied energistic crafting processors over there. Not see his massive amount of you know, ore processing over there. And of course, I don't want to dismantle this stuff. But I think it would be pretty cool if I could do that. Make it, like, psych them out. Make them think that it, that's, you know, what happened. That's where the massive, massive amount of inverted sky blocks comes in. Now, I made 10k, and of course I can't find them again. I have so much crap. There we go. I have over 10k. And I did a little bit math. If I create a box from this block... So basically just outside the stone stairs here to just outside the stone stairs on that side of the circle, on that side of the circle, and on that side of the circle from as far down as it goes. So basically underneath that glowy thing right there to above this section right here, it's going to take a little over 8,000, 8,000 inverted sky blocks. So I made 10,000 just to make sure I had enough left over. Um, hopefully this works. You know what? I haven't tried, and I just thought of this. I haven't tried um, to determine if that counts as inside, like if it blocks light or anything. If those, yeah, if the sky blocks block the light, though, he's got that giant thing up there, which probably isn't doing wonders for light anyways. Because it's pretty dark right there. Let's see. Weala says it's light level zero. Eh, he's not spawning any mobs. Oh, right, 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 right. He's above a mushroom biome. That's why he built here. So he doesn't have to worry about mobs. Okay, okay. So that's one less thing I have to worry about. <coughs> oh, excuse me. So what I want to do is take all of my inverted sky blocks. And as you can see, I took the wireless terminal. And I'm pretty, f I live pretty far over in that direction, but I extended my wireless terminal so I can reach over here. So I don't have to keep going back over there to get more s supplies. So I just, you boop there and I have it. So yeah, hopefully this works out. Um, I guess I'll find out if it works. I don't know what I'm going to do initially. I'll go up and then over and then later I'll go down and then over. And, uh, yeah, so hopefully if everything works out, the goal is so that he logs in, he can't see anything. He just sees sky. So it looks like his pizzas are gone. That's the goal. If that doesn't work out, if he's logged out somewhere else, hopefully, hopefully he'll turn this way and he'll see that pizza slice gone or something like that confuse the hell out of him hope that that's my goal i really really hope he records this uh he doesn't record that much because a lot of what he does is kind of tedious so um oh this is going to be a bitch because i'm not going to be able to actually see what the hell i'm doing <laughs> oh this is going to be entertaining to say the least um yeah so i will begin my task of causing myself severe frustration by making a giant box of invisible blocks that I'm not even going to be able to see. Like, there we go. We already have a problem. Uh, I have a magnet somewhere around here, but I also have way too much stuff in my inventory. <sighs> this is going to be entertaining.
need to take a stand Step up and show And there we have it, Invisible Pizza. I have a hole over there marked with a torch so I can find it again somewhere around there because I'd never be able to find it again. All right, so now I just need to put up the sign, which I should have a crafting. There we go. So let me get uh, six of those, and I should have a sign crafting tape. Or... Yeah, this thing. Ooh, I have five signs. All right, so again, the idea is that he's going to be like here, maybe, hopefully, when he logs in and goes, oh, my God, where's my pizza? Um, and yeah, OK, there's some flashy flashies, but hopefully uh, he just thinks it's another graphical glitch because we've got a lot of them. Or maybe, maybe if I'm really, really lucky. Uh, this is just a graphical glitch on my side, and it's not actually a problem on his computer. I am one short. Oh, yes. I totally just did a thing. Hang on. Boop. I did just ask for, what, five, six, and tried to make a nine by nine thing. Uh, all right. What do I want to say on this thing? I'm sorry. Did I make your pizza? I have no idea how to spell disappear. Hang on a second. I got to go to spell check. Uh, disappear? I'm sorry. Did I make your pizza disappear? And then we'll just sign this. Chrono. I may come back and change that sign later, but uh, for right now, that's good. Uh, and this did answer one thing. Uh, these inverted sky blocks, even though you can see the sky through them, mostly, they do make everything dark. So, yeah. Well, here's the hoping. So, that was my initial prank, my very first prank prank on the server oh and i put those away so i need one more i still have 2033 32 so i got pretty close to getting it right boop, boop. it shows there it shows on the map plop and it drops my frame rate something fierce i'm sorry i didn't know um, <laughs> 60 FPS, 18 FPS. <laughs> I didn't realize that it would do that. I guess it's possible that it would do that, but uh, I really did not expect it to do that. I just expected it not to render those blocks. I didn't expect it to render a sky image in front of those blocks instead of, you know, just not rendering those blocks. Eh, whatever. All right, so that was the initial prank on the Glitchcraft server. Like I said, outside of a uh, potato jetpack joke that I did to Flame that 
I'm sorry, I wasn't recording. So, this means a couple of things. One, this means that I'm going to have to start recording again, uh, much more regularly, because two, he's going to want to be getting me back, and hopefully he does something creative. Um, I like creative pranks. That one was... Eh, I don't know. If it wasn't so glitchy, if you couldn't see the uh, blocks, the sky blocks, which I like how you look up. You can't even see through the clouds to see my uh, power station. Come on. Where are you? Actually, hang on. Where are you? It should be right here. Where's my power? Ah, there it is. Okay. Yeah, so if they weren't glitchy like that, that would be really, really cool. Um, but hopefully this works out. I guess we'll see what comes of it. Because seriously, just being able to look out and not see anything, that that's, yeah. All right, so I will see you guys in the next episode, which hopefully will be sooner rather than later. Because, like I said, he going to be pranking me back, so I'm going to have to start recording regularly so I can catch the prank. So I'll see you guys in the next episode, and as always, keep playing the game and have fun.